up guys? Mad Dog EDC here coming at you with another video. I want to tell you today about a new member of our EDC family and that is RE Hanks. This is their red operator with the Ranger eye patch. Peel this off and you got your own little field of Velcro right there. This is the Maxpedition uh, Ranger eye, Mad Dog Ranger eye. That had nothing to do with me but of course I just absolutely had to have that. You can get your own RE patches put all put on these, and it, it adds a uh, cool little value to these hanks. They come with their own. As a matter of fact, this one I think had a uh, Umbrella Corporation um, Ranger Eye. Speaking of Ranger Eyes, Mad Dog EDC is coming out with their own pretty soon, so be ready for that. But these hanks are just the right size to fit in the back pocket. As a matter of fact, this one always sits with my wallet. And uh, you can see, fits right there in my left back pocket, just fine with my Maxpedition Micro Wallet. I've got a second one. This one is this is the one I normally wear for my formal carry. This is called the Gentleman Hank. It's got a cool little design on it right there. And uh, interesting thing on the back side of this, these this stitching right here is glow in the dark. So. Why do I carry these? You know, what's the point? Is this just pocket jewelry? Is there any real purpose to carrying this? Well, one, because we're, you know, out in the dust, out in the out in the water and everything with the irrigation job and all. I'm always getting things dirty. Always, uh, my screen's always getting stuff all over it. So let's uh, wipe off our phone screen. Yes, I'm using my phone to film this. You know, I carry my Samsung Galaxy tablet every once in a while. I gotta clean that screen off so I can. That's just scratches on it. That's not dirt. <laughs> I gotta clean it off so I can see what I'm doing with it. My Garmin smartwatch. This thing gets filthy, gets dirt and mud all around the bezel there. So, gotta clean it off. Make sure that's all good and clean. What about our knives? You've seen how much this Gerber strong arm gets abused as a matter of fact look right there see how much that thing's been sharpened down you know how much that how many times this thing gets stabbed in the dirt all the time guess what wipe the blade off what about our tesseract tactical nf1 you've seen the picture of this thing if not go over to the facebook page and check it out you've seen the picture of this knife this bead, this lanyard, covered in mud, just nasty. That's right. Clean it right off. If you've been following the Facebook page and some of my EDC dumps, you know that I'm now wearing the Shox OpenCom Bone Conduction Headset. Clean those... Uh, pads off right there that sit right up against your ears because you know it gets sweat on it every once in a while you got to clean that off speaking of sweat wipe that right off you know carry a hank sometimes i carry i also carry a uh, a red bandana usually for that purpose but you know there's absolutely nothing wrong with taking this cloth right here and if you want to just carry one wipe the spot off your brow so right in the rain notebooks i use these things a lot because well they're right in the rain, you know, they're waterproof. Get up there, I'm trying to take some notes on a job or something like that. Well, what I'm able to do is get that water off of there real quick so I can write pretty good. So there's a lot of uses uh, for me on these here, but I know there's a lot of people out there that might not be in the irrigation business or the landscape business or lawn maintenance or working out in the mud and the dirt and everything like I am, but you still got to clean that phone screen off. You're still going to have to take care of your smartwatches. Not everyone's wearing a Garmin, but maybe you got the Samsung. Maybe you got the Apple Watch. Keep that watch all nice and clean. Your phones, like I said, your tablets, your laptops. Clean your laptop screens off. No, use it. You touch to uh, freshen yourself up or something. Maybe you gotta, you know. Sometimes just the cloth is all you need to be able to get this uh, get this facial hair in order. You know, just dab it there. So you never know when a hank is gonna come in handy. Gentlemen of all ages used to carry a hank in their back pocket. I've got a couple uh, uh, 
silk hanks that I carry with my formal carry. One of them belonged to my granddad. So this is not a new thing. This is not something that guys just started using. I carried hanks for quite some time as uh, part of a, a gentleman's carry. So hanks are de definitely have their place in an EDC. They're not just uh, some pocket jewelry. And now, yeah, it's fun to get things like this and have your patches and everything all over it, but it's not always just that. So what do you need to do? You need to go to rehanks.com, check out the selection that they have there. They've got two pages worth of Hanks for you to choose from. Get you a Hank, order that thing, support a uh, small USA made business. John does all these things by himself. His wife's there in the shop helping him out. So y'all go support a good American family. Get you an RE Hank. Now,